love you. Me love you, me love you, me love you, me love you. No one can love you. No girl can take the place you have in my life. Give me the, give me the, give me your time. Tell me I said me not wasting your time. Hey, what's up, my crowns and tiaras? Welcome to Etoxic Tea Lounge. Everything in this video is allegedly, all right? Now, we got a quite a few people today up in the building. We're going to be talking about Blueface, Jamie Foxx, Akbar V, Renee Grisano, Bad Baby, Ice Spice, Nicki Minaj, 50 Cent, whatever. We got a bunch of people to talk about today, so make sure y'all stay tuned and watch throughout the whole video. If you have any questions or have to say anything about it, make sure to comment down below. Everybody is welcome, even the haters, and I said what I said. So I'm going to be saying a, a quite a few things in here, so buck your seatbelts now let's talk about blue face all right so blue face recently went online did a video regarding women who do only fans or any type of profession when it comes to sex exchange for money all right now let me know after y'all hear what he has to say down in the comments below do you agree or do you not agree okay i just feel like i just want to throw blue face in the garbage that's how i feel i don't know who needed this but if you have a sex on only fans you are a prostitute only women can be prostitutes, men cannot be prostitutes. That's a hell of a double standard right there. I know, it's crazy. It's crazy. I don't know who can deal with this man. Like, he just so annoying. Like, he does a, a lot of double standards, okay? Men can definitely be in that type of field. They definitely can. There's a lot of them out here, okay? Now, my thing is this. Why do Blueface even care? You having sex with a whole bunch of women regardless, and I'm pretty sure you gave them some money. Regardless if it was an exchange, but like, here, give me this for that. If you're giving females money and you're having sexual stuff with them, that's still something. You're still giving up something, okay? So I just felt like he's a whole narcissist. He's very annoying. I don't know who can deal with this man. Like, he's so annoying. I'm not on bond. I'm on probation, suspension, detention, ramification, limitation. I am still y'all niggas got some shit going on. License suspended, banned from Vegas. I can't hang out. I'm sorry, guys. I am still y'all like miss me. Let me get my shit together and get back right. Seems like he got a lot of legal stuff going on. So my thing is this, Blueface. Worry about yourself, focus on, you know, getting things better in your life, changing up your image, start, you know, have a different brain, because at this point, just throw the whole person away, like, for real, he's just mad annoying, you on here worried about females and what they doing with their cootie cats, and what they, like, what money they getting, don't worry about that, worry about you and Krishan Rock, because y'all got a baby on the way, right? Y'all allegedly got a baby on the way, so focus on becoming another dad. It's going to be your third child, okay? And just get it together. You'll be worried about the wrong things. And then it's like, boy, just throw him away. Now, Corinne Fox, I'm not sure if I'm saying her name right, um, Jamie Foxx's daughter, has some things that she wants to say regarding her dad's health. You know, he had a medical issue going on. Now, the sources are saying he had a stroke and had surgery. She is not saying this in this message that I'm about to read to y'all. So please make sure to pay attention. She says, from the Fox family, we wanted to share that my father, Jamie Foxx, experienced a medical complication yesterday. Luckily, due to quick action and great care, he is already on his way to recovery. We know how beloved he is and appreciate your prayers. The family asks for privacy during this time. Much love, the Fox family. All right, y'all. So I'm glad that Jamie Foxx is okay. I need everybody to please make sure to check yourselves out, okay? Everybody could be sitting with something that they're, they're overlooking, the doctors are overlooking, and sometimes you probably won't even have symptoms. It's just straight on just there, all right? So please, everybody, make sure to keep up with your health, all right, y'all? Now, it was looking like Miss Akbar Reed got some beef with Jason Lee, okay? You already know Akbar always throw things out, being drama, and turn around and be like, but I am not in the business. I am trying to live a peaceful life. I am doing this and this and that. Girl, bye. All right, now, look what she got to say, y'all. All right, she says... About your surgery and other things, we was very cordial soon as me and, and old girl get into it. Haven't saw one good post. Just stop posting me, bro. Y'all don't got to post me. Post my music. Not no fake wanna be drama. Y'all wanna happen so bad. Jason Lee, I know you get paid to speak negative about me because not once have you posted a freestyle or anything positive about me. All you post is mad weird stuff about me. And I never once disrespected you or had one problem with you. Oh, 
how we forgot the times you called me. Okay. She also says the blogs post something and here come all the haters. Akbar this and I, and that. Akbar ain't even knowing what y'all talking about till someone send me something. And Akbar don't care what y'all think. Because I can rap and I'm at peace. God's timing. Y'all really fans of mine. I wish folks stopped thinking they know about music and industry. It takes more than just music to enter in these top 100, top 10s. Please stop thinking you know everything. Y'all can't keep making jokes about I don't have a billboard hit. I'll have one soon. I don't have no machine behind me. So she basically saying people that got, you know, is on the list, they got machines behind them. Let's normalize having a disagreement without beefing. I just feel like as a grown woman, you should always speak on how you feel no matter who it is. Some people pick and choose. Tell who they want to tell or just never speak on it at all. I'm glad I've always been a person who speaks my mind. Ain't nothing getting past me, okay? She also says, and that's even crazier, is a lot of great food things has been happening in my life. You never see this man post anything positive about me. I've been chilling, focused on meetings about budgets for my project, soon to drop. And thinking um, about nothing crazy or y'all think I'm talking about, but why do I even got to explain that? Let me chill. I'm off this. Everyone have a blessed day. Now, it looks like Jason Lee about to sue some people. Do not know if Akbar one of them, but he is going through some things because, you know, at him as a blogger and him speaking his mind, he's going to go through these type of things. Now, he says, that's the energy I'm on in case you didn't know. By the way, I'm looking at suing a few people. Y'all going to stop playing with my name. I'm okay with you criticizing my work or opinions. That's fair. But when you try to play with my name, especially with the sick stuff, I'm going to come for you and destroy all your stuff, okay? I've been in a deep thought since the passing of my friend. I'm establishing boundaries with everybody. I thought I had them but before, but I'm building barricades now. Now, I understand what he's, he's going through something, y'all, all right? Now, listen, he's a blogger. A lot of us is going to speak our opinions. We're going to say what we want to say and pop our stuff. Y'all don't got to like it at all, okay? But it is what it is. I thought she always, oh, uh, this and this and that. Like, girl, go sit down. Now, look at this, y'all. She goes and retweets. These guys will trade a home for a H-O-E. Also says, hubby loves me. He be on it, okay? Number 24. She also says, I'm in love and at peace, because y'all already know her last suit that just came out, okay? Um, me and my guy still together. We ain't broke up. We just been tweeting stuff. I ain't coming up off of him. And then she put the 24 again. I got a good man. That's why I'm patient with him, and she adds him, okay? She also had put this. My next relationship will be my last, so I'm not looking. I'm not worried. I'm not rushing. I want this love to find me, learn me, want me, need me, and love me in slow motion because we have forever to go. Now, she's bipolar, y'all. I'm not one of the type to be in a relationship and post on my breakups and get back together it's like it's just weird to me all right so clearly she's still with him but just you see you see she says she's waiting for her next love so it's like they did break up they're back together it is what it is it happens a lot of people do it it is what it is but my thing is this girl you want to be in peace you in love what is a girl try to focus on the peace for real because you always say this and turn around in some drama or putting your nose in something where it don't belong it's all right like it's just it's just giving very much i'm bored focus on your music all right do the project that's supposedly coming out work on your craft okay girl just do what you gotta do now renee grisano grisano whatever um from mob wives is getting a lot of backlash she took this picture and everybody's looking at the mirror reflection it's like who is that lady right there and they're coming for her natural look i guess because she didn't pay attention to you know what was going on in the picture people was trying to come for her but i'll talk about that in a minute someone please tell renee that mirrors are snitches that reflection looks like it escaped from middle earth mob wives okay is this renee grisano so who's the girl in the mirror then? Um, this is what happens when you say Bloody Mary in the mirror only two and a half times. She looks like she's melting. All right, let me get straight into this, all right, y'all? Because a lot of the people that's coming for her, her natural look or whatever the case may be, she is an older woman. Her looks is not going to always be there. All of our looks is not going to be perfect, okay? I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all that's behind them pictures 
that's not yours on the default. Y'all don't even put your own faces on the, on your default pictures. You barely have pictures of yourself natural. A lot of y'all on here, a lot of y'all women out here is embarrassed of your natural face because you wear filters all over your Instagram and you wear makeup all damn day. Do anybody even know your real true self look like? Do you even know how you look? Y'all need to stop because there's a lot of females doing this. Like, a lot of the comments are females. Y'all need to get it together. Why do we care about the next woman's beauty, okay? Like, focus on your own confidence and focus on showing your face. <laughs> like, y'all females, y'all get me like, ugh. Yes, you might see somebody be like, oh, they're not really that attractive. That's fine. Everybody has their own opinions. I might not be attracted to some men or some woman, and that's cool because I know I'm beautiful and I'm confident. But a uh, a uh, 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 shows her natural face pimples um um all type of stuff i don't even care all right so learn to love yourself y'all stop worried about the next woman's face now it's looking like miss bad baby got a new booski okay y'all already know she was talking about chief keith and she in love and all the tattoos she got of him and all type of stuff all right but she has a new boo yes this is um lv game lv do not even know who he is but he posted this he got her name tatted on his neck yes he sure did and she Got his name tatted right in red, right there. Lavon. Okay. They got a little bit of pictures, little couple pictures going on. They look happy, or whatever the case may be. Somebody says, he is cute, but didn't shoot the fact that you went a whole different female name tattoo on you who's not your BM. The industry be weird. They really worse than us regular people. Now he do have a son. His son looks very young. Do not know what's going on with him and his baby mother. Clearly, they're not together because he's with Miss Bad Baby. I don't know. To me, that's a little bit of a red flag. The baby's way too young, and I, I, I'm wondering, like, what is going on over there? They all young, to be honest with you, but look what Miss Bad Baby said. She said, Mother Effers can't even tell me what my favorite color is, but want to tell me about what I got going on in my personal life. Grow up. I ain't saying nothing else. I'm losing brain cells, even feeding into this made-up old hate and stuff. Now, listen, y'all. Everybody in the industry is going to be with somebody, okay? Not everything is going to work out. So, yes, people are going to be moving from one person to the next if it doesn't work out. That's just how life is. So, why do y'all feel the need to want to bash somebody because she talked about this guy or that guy or she was with this guy? Who cares? She could do what she want to do just like y'all do what y'all want to do. And majority of y'all do what y'all want to do. When I tell y'all, y'all be in these streets and these projects and the staircases. Just give it up. Now, Miss Ice Spice been doing her thing in these magazines. This is the paper magazine where she's looking real cute, all right? She's sticking to this hair, and she's just doing her thing. Now, it's some rumors that Ice Spice and Nicki Minaj has a collab coming up. It's supposed to be a remix of Princess Diana, okay? Yes, yeah, somebody did this, Princess Diana little cover with Ice Spice and Nicki Minaj looking dolls. I'm all for it, y'all. Now, Ice Spice has been doing her thing, but she recently, after paper magazine or whatever, has some something to say in the media she said i feel like it's a new lane that i've started and i'm starting to hear a lot of other artists sound like they belong in my lane now i ain't gonna lie you already know ice spice got her own flow and sound okay it is a couple people that are artists that's coming up or whatever the case may be that do kind of sound similar to her but it is what it is she's in her cocky little mold as she should a lot of people in the industry get in that little zone that they have it is what it is all right but i'm all for it okay it seems like Nicki minaj is definitely doing her thing in the music but i'm still waiting for an album but let's see are y'all here for the Nicki minaj and ice spice remix for princess diana because i sure am now, last but not least, 50 Cent recently went on his Instagram and posted that him and Nicki Minaj has some work coming up, okay? Yes, they're working together, and can y'all guess what it is? Guess, guess, guess. Yes, he puts this up. It says, Nicki Minaj is the lead animated series Lady Danger, and it works at Freebie from Curtis 50 Cent Jackson, all right? And then basically he said, what you doing today? We working. He at Nicki Minaj. Now, also, Nicki Minaj retweeted at this, so this is, you know, Deadline Hollywood said exclusive. Nicki Minaj is set to executive produce and star in Lady Danger, a new animated series from Amazon Freebie based on a dark 
horse comic book series of the same name Deadline has learned. Yes, I feel like Nicki Minaj needs to branch out a little bit more. Um, still waiting on the album. She is doing some features and she did come up with some couple songs that recently came out that I like. So, you know, so she's doing her thing. She's working and she's, you know, getting her bag. I would love to see females in the industry have less drama, work together, get the bag together. And, you know, put the differences aside because I really would love, love, love to see Nicki Minaj and Cardi B make some songs because i feel like that stuff will be fire i ain't gonna lie their songs will just hit like have hits like billboards for days like i ain't gonna lie to you but anyways i said what i said throughout this video you do not have to uh, agree okay we could agree to disagree but i'm still gonna pop my stuff okay so let me know what y'all think about blue face talking about women and their, you know what they do with their cooch and money and all type of stuff and the double standard that he put out there talking about men can't be you know, men can't be in that field when it comes to money in exchange for sex, etc. Jamie Foxx, like I said, I'm glad that he's doing okay. Everybody, please check your health. Um, Akbar addresses Jason Lee. What do y'all think about that? Renee Grisanio with people coming for her natural looks and all type of stuff. Let me know what y'all think about that. Bad Baby and her new boo. Do y'all think it's going to last or not? Okay, Ice Spice working with Nicki Minaj. All the barbs out there, I'm pretty sure y'all is really with it. Because y'all already know that Ice Spice recently was, you know, chilling with Cardi B and everybody else. And everybody felt the need that, I guess, if two females or two men in the industry is beefing, you can't work with them. You gotta pick a side. You don't gotta pick a side. That's not her best friend. She don't have to pick a side to anything. Like, they're in the industry. They're making music. They're making money. And it is what it is. Hopefully, Ice Spice... Don't let this little collab that her and Nicki Minaj got going on for her to start acting funny to Cardi B and whoever else because that's not going to look good for her um, or her music in this game. Don't want to start that beef, Ice Spice. I'm telling you, you better not pick no sides because dealing with Nicki Minaj, she wants people to pick a side and if you don't pick a side, you're going to be on her bad side. And I said what I said. 50 Cent and Nicki Minaj, I'm all for it. Freebie is definitely free, okay? Just get the app watch that stuff so we do not know any more about it but we do know that it's in the works but anyways let me know what y'all think about everything let me know hit me up and i love y'all